Hello friends, this is Mohamed Shakil here and in this tutorial series I'll be showing you how you can design a screwdriver with KTAV5. Here's our completed design of the screwdriver and here's the work in progress. So now select this face here go for offset And just uh, let me hold the screwdriver and see how long would that be. Maybe a one centimeter will be sufficient. Or else you could go for 1.5 centimeter. Okay, that's good. Now select that face and click on the sketch. So let's just uh, look back at the completed design and see how it is. So that's how I've done that see here so it's pretty simple you know any design is a company a combination of uh, you know right right features and right sketches etc so it's up to you how you complete a design now you could let me see the screwdriver now maybe maybe this much would be required yeah exit the sketch now you could go for a multi section select this one and okay before that just select this face and click on the sketch and select this rectangle go for a dotted rectangle and drag this here and now you could project this you could uh, select this circle project it and then use the coincidence command and then make it normal and now what you can do is select one one disable the dotted line select the next point disable the construction these points are required for us to do the coupling So the reason why these points are difficult to be selected is because my system is running really really slow. I guess there are uh, background applications and I apologize you for that. And now you could go for multi-section. This one and this one. And go for coupling and just add, start adding the couplings one and two one and two one and two and the last one and just remove the replace the closing point in order to keep the closing point just come to the top view just keep it somewhere here closer and just look for the other closing point replace and keep it here now click on the preview alright 
and that's what we have. So if you feel that it's pretty thick, what you can do is always you have an option to decrease the size backspace and now let's see what can be done in the next part to complete the screwdriver design and I hope you enjoyed this tutorial and let me increase this height a little bit okay and I uh, if you have any doubts just comment below the video let's see what can be done in the next part thank you so much and stay tuned